Mr. President, Salam Foundation, together with the Bahrain Center for Human Rights, would like to call the Council attention to the status of human rights defenders and the prisoner of conscience in Bahrain. Three months ago, I completed two years arbitrary prison sentence in Bahrain. I am deeply grateful to all those who called for my release throughout my sentence. The dedication of all those who worked on my behalf and other imprisoned Bahraini human rights defenders continue to move me month after my release. However, though I am free, other human rights defenders like Abdul Hadi Al Khawaja, Maryam Al Khawaja, Abdul Jalil Singhez, Naji Fatil, as well as many other remain in Bahraini detention. This count of reprisal against a human rights defender make up only a portion of the nearly 4,000 political prisoners held under charges largely related to free expression and, or assembly. With the experience in mind, we repeat the call of 47 member states that Bahrain release all prisoners imprisoned only for exercising human rights, including human rights defenders, some of whom have been identified as arbitrarily detained. We also call on the Office of the High Commission to continue to critically engage Bahrain regarding the ongoing arbitrary detention of thousands of political prisoners in Bahrain. We believe that Office of the High Commissioner can play a constructive role in facilitating the release of these prisoners and an easing of the country expensive terrorism laws restricting free assembly and expression. Such step by the Office of the High Commissioner and the government would be a welcome beginning to the renewed process of necessary reform. Thank you. I thank you and I'll give the floor to the Organization for Defending Victims of Violence.